On this James the Bike Guy, we're taking a look at some Shimano 105 ST R7025 dual control levers. This is a hydraulic dual control lever from Shimano, and the 7020 would be the hydraulic version. 7025 is the hydraulic small hands version. So let's go ahead and take a look at what the small hands version of the Shimano 105 hydraulic levers is, and we'll compare it to the standard ones. While I get the package open, go ahead and be sure to click the subscribe button if you haven't already. That way you can see videos like this into the future. So inside of our packaging here, you're gonna get both the levers, some hydraulic lines, mineral oil to be able to bleed the brakes, because the uh, levers themselves are going to be mineral oil. Now, when you order the ST7025, it's not gonna come with the calipers. So this is really updating either a set of brakes you already have, such as an older set of 105 levers, or just to be able to get the new shape. Now, taking a look at these, this is gonna be really similar to the traditional 105 levers, so the STR7020 levers. But what's gonna change is really in the shape of the blade. So the blade of this shifter, you can see, is fairly wide. It comes out to the side uh, a bit. You can actually see that profile kind of pops itself out to the side. And then you're gonna have a much wider flat portion on this 105 lever blade. And when you look at that compared to the standard brake, you can see that it's definitely going to make a difference in both the width and how far over your hand has to go to get to the brake lever. The other thing that's different is actually going to be in the reach. So this does have a shorter reach to the shift paddles. And that means everything is kind of tucked back and pulled back so that it's going to make it much, much more comfortable for smaller hands. Now. For somebody with medium hands, I think you'd actually still like this brake lever better. You know, I've, I've been messing around with it. It definitely seems to be more comfortable to me than the traditional version. So if you have the option of getting a short reach lever, I'd highly suggest it. Now taking a look at some of the technology behind this shift lever, there's going to be a few things that really come down from Ultegra R8000. And that's gonna be the shifting mechanism inside is actually gonna be the same. So that pulls down from R8000, so you're gonna get some high quality shift mechanism. And then the front shifting is also gonna be just like the Ultegra version. Now that means this is gonna work with that uh, cam driven style front derailleur. And that's gonna give the front shifting the same kind of light action as what you get with the rear shifting on the bike. Now, under the hood of this lever, you can see that this is a plastic body. You can actually see where the master cylinder is in this lever and the bleed port for it. So that's gonna make it really easy to control. And it's going to have replaceable hood rubber on here. So you can replace this into the future uh, as this wears. Now you do have a traditional metal bar clamp, so this is gonna run anywhere from that 23.8 to 24.2 diameter for the bar clamp. And just overall, it's pretty nice. So you've got that plastic body, the lever itself is gonna be made out of uh, some resin material. And then for the paddles and the shift mechanisms on the inside, you can see that those are gonna be made out of steel. So now that we've taken a look at these shift levers, Let's go ahead and place them onto a scale and we'll see what they weigh in at. So the pair of Shimano STR7025 shift levers are gonna come in at a pretty lightweight 622 grams. Well, thanks for watching this video on the Shimano small hands edition of the Shimano 105 R7025 brake levers. Go ahead and let me know your thoughts down in the comments below. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already, and smash that like button if you enjoyed the video.